the world of education, success is hard to define. The first step is establishing a common goal. School administrators, policy analysts, and government officials have all begun using the term post-secondary attainment when talking about success. Post-secondary broadly refers to schooling pursued after completing high school. Attainment refers to some sort of degree or credential, something that would help you find a job. That could be a degree from college, like a bachelor's or associate degree. It could also be a certificate in welding or a license that lets you drive school buses. These are all types of post-secondary attainment, but why has this become our new standard for success? In short, the economy in North Carolina demands it. By 2020, an estimated 67% of all jobs will require some education and training beyond high school. So where does North Carolina stand right now? As of 2016, 47% of North Carolina's 5.3 million working-age adults had a post-secondary degree or non-degree credential. 5% had a non-degree credential, and the other 42% had an associate degree or higher. It's great that North Carolinians have degrees equal to the national average, but this is largely the result of highly educated people moving here recently. Between 1990 and 2016, the state's population of working age adults with an associate degree or higher grew by 1.3 million. 70% of those people were born in another state or country. For North Carolina-born residents, the post-secondary attainment rate is only 35%. That's significantly behind the rate for residents born elsewhere, which is closer to 50%. This isn't the only area where wide gaps in attainment exist. 50% of women have some form of post-secondary attainment, while men lag behind at 44%. Geographically, urban areas tend to have higher attainment than rural ones. Orange, Wake, Durham, and Mecklenburg are the only four counties where most adults have an associate degree or higher. 87 of North Carolina's 100 counties are below the state average for attainment. Among racial and ethnic subgroups, 67% of North Carolina's Asian working age adults held a post-secondary degree or non-degree credential in 2016. This is the My Future NC Commission. It's comprised of business leaders, policymakers, philanthropists, and other experts. Their job was to identify a statewide attainment goal and issue a call to action for the state of North Carolina. On February 20th, they announced the statewide attainment goal. By 2030, 2 million 25 to 44 year olds will have a post-secondary degree or high quality credential. That's about two thirds of this age group in 2030. How do we get there? There are many ways, and we'll take a look at that next time. I'm Rebecca Tippett, Director of Carolina Demography.